What is suspension trauma? Over the years, we have done such a good job of wearing harnesses and lanyards and properly connecting to anchor points that when an actual fall happens, we do not think of the consequences. When a fall occurs, even though our life was saved and we didn't hit the ground because we were suspended, these straps here have actually cut off blood flow down into our legs. And what does this mean? Well, when blood flow has been cut off, that flow has been restricted. So it is not pulled back up into your heart and you start to lose oxygen in the blood flowing throughout your body, including the blood flowing to the brain. Now, the suspension is very dangerous and could cause you to pass out, go into cardiac arrest, endure brain damage, and even die. This lack of blood flow could also cause blood clots within your legs. So the longer you are suspended and creating pressure here on your legs, the more likely you are to suffer from suspension trauma. The faster we can get you down, the better. Fortunately, we have what are known as suspension trauma safety straps. These straps are attached to your harness and are located on each side of your body. If you were to fall and are dangling, unzip these packs and pull out the straps. To connect the straps together, raise the ends of the straps to locate the hook and loops. Insert the hook into the appropriate loop and lower the strap. Now you have a strap that you can put your legs and feet in, relieving the pressure being applied to the arteries and veins around the top of your legs and allowing you to have blood flowing to your heart. These trauma straps let you keep your legs moving, blood circulating and muscles working, and all of this prevents you from suffering suspension trauma while waiting for emergency personnel to get you down.